This Juneteenth, a group of high schoolers is paying homage to a special part of Metro Detroit's history. Teens are playing a game of baseball at the historic Hamtramck Stadium in honor of a pioneering member of the Negro Leagues. Victor Williams live in Hamtramck this evening where the tribute game, I guess, is just wrapped up, Victor. Yes, Devin, it's just wrapped up and this was really a rededication that was truly something special. What better day to do this than on the holiday of Juneteenth? I can remember playing uh, here when I was at Wayne State University, and uh, this place is so much improved over that that it's really remarkable. If Martin Luther King could have a field of dreams, this would be it. So it's, it's really beautiful. Former Negro Leagues coach and star player Ron Teasley knows that all too well. It was a, it was a great uh, venue for, 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 for fans to come out and watch a good black baseball. Today, Teasley was honored at the historic Hamtramck Stadium. One, three, one, two, three, the field packed with players like it's the 1930s. But this time, it's in more of an appreciative climate. With players from Detroit Edison High like Marwin Matthews draped in the original attire, it's a way to pay homage with new players in old gear. Uh, this is Detroit Stars from the Negro Leagues, and I'll be playing out on the Detroit Stars team today. And on the other end, Jacoby Radcliffe is here repping the American Giants from Chicago. I feel like I'm part of the, um, the old times where they, um, they were very great, and I just feel like I'm supposed to be here. But playing on Juneteenth makes it so much better. That makes it very special. That's like, that's a once in a lifetime thing right there. All of this happening during June the 10th, that's just, that's really a blessing right there. And you can't have this program without first honoring those who literally paved the way for African Americans in the game to begin with. It's something that Teasley is glad finally happened. It's something it's long overdue, I think, and I think that uh, it just continues. I think uh, America will be on the right track. And to cap off all of the festivities, there was a huge picnic that took place right on this very field. And Hamtramck reporting live tonight, Victor Williams, Local 4. I love it. And you could see how much it meant to these young players to be wearing those that, that, that great iconic uniform. Great stuff. All right, Victor. Oh, yeah.